Okay, this is uh, Minerva Park. You would easily miss it. It's just by Daniel Yanovsky Street here, uh, going up towards the Tayelet in Jerusalem. And it's this little park here off the side of the road. We're coming up to sunset in Jerusalem. So this is the, it's labeled in Google as Minerva Park. And I read in the media once that it was considered as a potential site for an American embassy building. I'm not sure that's true. This little park is located just off the intersection of Daniel Yanovsky Street and Derek Hebron, Hebron Road there and uh, the entrance is just uh, okay so just uh, climbed up the little uh, walk here up from the road from Daniel Yanovsky Street and um, it's quite overgrown but there's a little path here leading through the park and the colors are beautiful this is actually a great time to visit because uh, sunset is happening just right now here in Jerusalem and you can see this uh, it's, um, I looked on Google Maps, it's a few hundred meters on each side, so it's roughly a square. Um, but the lighting right now is amazing just because of the fact that the sun is setting here. And uh, the trees are uh, quite tall, so it's amazing how many of these little parks, urban parks, green lungs there are in Jerusalem if you just go out and discover them. Evidence that this place is used for uh, bonfires, there's a little clearing here with some ashes. These are some of the random things you can discover if you uh, go exploring the random parks in your city. There's a couple of chairs here. This place could use a cleanup. Um, some rubbish, I guess teenagers use this place for drinking alcohol or stuff like that. I'm going to start referring to this place as the wilderness of Minerva because this is more like a wilderness than a park. It's just kind of too overgrown and random. There's little ridges, there's a little uh, concrete trellis I'm walking on at the moment. And who would have thought that this place is just off Yanovsky Street in Jerusalem? I generally always got the feeling that this was like just a tiny little nothing park. There's even kind of these uh, ridges up here. There's also a uh, caperberry plant here, so if you're looking to get some caperberries for your pizza or for your other culinary needs, then uh, you can go and uh, get them here. Thank you guys for checking out this uh, YouTube video. This is the Minerva Park. It's labeled in Google Maps as such. I checked in the Jerusalem Municipality's GIS system and for whatever reason it wasn't even labeled. So, but if you type it in English, you'll be able to find it. Thanks you guys for watching this video and if you'd like to get more videos from me exploring Jerusalem and Israel and what can be found in this fascinating part of the world, then please feel free to hit the subscribe button. Thank you guys for watching.